Welcome to Jack Fleming Artistry. This is the second video that I'm posting for this year. It's actually the first one that I'm making this year. I find it kind of funny because the last video that I posted was of me making a pinstripe panel that was on carbon fiber for a charity auction at Houston Autorama. And this time I am putting together a video for you of a panel that I'm making for the Dallas Autorama art auction. Uh, let's go ahead and get started with it. Okay, this panel is going to be a little bit more traditional than that last one that I did. The last one was really cool because I had a carbon fiber company reach out to me and we collaborated on that one. This one I'm using an aluminum sign panel that I had here at the house. Started off with a little bit of custom paintwork on it. Unfortunately, I deleted the video from that. Uh, there is a short out there that contains a little bit of of that kind of work in it but you're gonna have to wait for the tape pull in this video in order to see what that paintwork looks like for now let's keep watching a little bit more of that gold leaf action that we got going on here some engine turning and whatnot and listen to some music while we do it man okay so we got the leaf work done and now it's time to peel that tape and see what it looks like and give you guys a shot of the custom paintwork that I did on it you know I realize that not everybody that watches this YouTube channel probably knows what a pinstripers panel jam is I had the opportunity geez I guess it was probably four maybe even five years ago I think maybe a little bit more than that to go to my first one at the Dallas Autorama in, in Dallas, Texas here, they, they had a group there. I think they were going for like 10 years or so before COVID started. And what they do is all these pinstripers would get together and paint together for the weekend. And then during that time, they'd auction the pieces off and the pieces would go to charity. There's a bunch of panel jams all over the country. Um, a lot of times they're your larger car shows. A lot of the Autoramas have them. I know there's a really big one in Syracuse. I think there's one that might be pretty big in uh, California uh, at the Grand National Roadster Show. There's a big one in Chicago. There, there's several of them. There's several of them across the country. The one that I went to down in Houston was pretty small um, comparatively. And there's some small ones. I've been to another one where there was just three artists there, me and two other people now. But it's really cool. You get an opportunity to work together with your peers, um, learn some stuff from each other. Really, one of the coolest parts of it is you get to see the, the artists and stuff that you know that you might not get to see other times. Um, if you're not a pinstriper and then you're coming to view one of these things, it's kind of exciting. You get to see all this stuff being made and really understand how this stuff comes together. I'm pretty excited about this year uh, where this is concerned because, like I, I mentioned there briefly, whenever the whole shutdown thing happened with COVID, the panel jam that was here... Obviously, it wasn't able to happen because the Autorama wasn't able to happen. And then for a little while there, after the Autorama was back, we still didn't have the panel jam. Um, I feel really grateful, I guess. I was able to get together a group of artists and get permission from the people who were running the panel jam before in, in Dallas and start a new one bring it back so this year will be the first year of it coming back we're calling it the great texas panel jam at least that's the the name we have at the moment for it i don't know if that'll change but it's really exciting i've got i think 15 artists that's counting myself that will be there this year painting together and auctioning stuff off and all that money's going to go to the children's hospital we've got a lot of the people that were involved before um with the panel jam that are coming back as artists and you know a total new group of people this time that are running it so it should be a pretty cool show with that said usually artists when they come to these they bring one to two pieces to donate this year we only had like two months really to get this thing totally prepared so 
I asked uh, each of the artists to bring at least one piece. And we've even got artists from other parts of the country that are donating pieces because they want to do their part to help out. I think it's really, really cool. Super cool opportunity. You know, as the tape comes off on this piece here, you're starting to see the colors that I have on it. Um, be a little hard to tell, but I went through and where all the tape that's been peeled off so far is that edge there. I took the airbrush and gave that just a little bit of a shadow to give it a little bit of depth. And then underneath the tape here is some texture that's really super subtle that I came up with and experimented on really like. If we zoom in, maybe you can see that. Okay, so we just finished doing all the leaf work on it and the engine turning. Next comes our pinstripes, and I probably won't show you the whole thing during that. Save it for the end. So let's go ahead and get those stripes going so you guys can see how this thing turns out. Alright, it's freshly done. It's still wet. My brushes are clean, but here it is. You can kind of turn it a little bit here and you can see how that gold leaf really looks. Um, I left a lot of space open on this one for negative space. I like the way that that looks design-wise. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. Okay, thank you guys for joining me again on this. That panel, as I stated, will be at the Dallas Autorama in February. This video will definitely come out before that, if you're watching this video after that. Uh, maybe I saw you there at the show. Um, that'd be pretty cool. If not, I'm doing car shows all the time, almost every weekend. Come find me. I've got art for sale. I've got prints for sale, shirts for sale stickers if you can't find me at a car show find me on my website it's www.jackflemingartistry.com really appreciate all the support that's out there and i really hope people come out and support this event that we're doing here um the panel jam at autorama and hopefully it'll be a yearly thing and we can see you there um pick one of the videos here keep watching maybe there's something else you guys like Tell me down in the comments if there is something you'd like to see me make a video on. Hope you guys are having a great year. Bye.